morning, Sunrisers. I'm Dr. Karen Emerson, and today I have with me my technician, Katie. And this cute little girl is Gypsy. Gypsy was actually adopted from a shelter uh, a few months back. She's now 13 months old, and she actually uh, was found with a mutilation to her, the left side of her face um, that caused an injury to her eye. Um, so she never would hold her eye completely open. She actually was suffering from something called entropion where the eyelid itself was curved in. So every time she blinked, her little eyelashes were rubbing her eye. Um, this can be something that cats are born with and dogs. But like I said, hers basically occurred from a traumatic event. Um, her owner rescued her and she brought her in a few weeks ago. And I was like, yeah, I can do this surgery. Let's do it. Let's make Gypsy uh, have a better quality of life instead of having to constantly have her eye closed. Because I don't know if you guys out there, if you've ever gotten an eyelash in your eye, that pain and irritation that you feel during that, just imagine that at a constant rate, 24 hours a day. So what we did, we actually did surgery yesterday. We went in and we're going to get a close up in a minute. And I actually took out a portion of uh, Gypsy's lower eye. I ba basically did like a crescent moon removal of tissue and then I sutured that tissue back together to bring that eyelid out to an angle where the uh, lashes are not rubbing on the inside of the eye. You will notice when you look at her face that her left eye does look smaller than her right eye uh, externally but of course that is due to the injury. So with that simple procedure uh, that we did. Gypsy can now have a better quality of life. She's not going to actually have to constantly be squinting, uh, not able to see well, and in constant pain. So if you have an animal that you notice, maybe that they're squinting a lot, or they're keeping their eyes, you know, closed, or they're blinking a lot, or they don't want to really go out in the sun because it's kind of bright, or you notice a lot of drainage or a lot of pawing or rubbing at the eye, those are all signs that there's something going on either with the lid itself or the eye. So call and make that appointment. There are so many things that we can do to make your pet's quality of life better. Um, so they'll live a good, good quality of life. So if you have any questions, please give us a call and I promise your pets will thank you. WCBI Animal Health with Dr. Emerson was brought to you by Emerson Animal Hospital in West Point.